many days is yet to come. Hey guys, welcome back to the shop. Today I'm going to do a real quick turning. Um, this is a perfect example here where I said that don't throw away your off cuts. This is an off cut from a pen I done, I don't know, a couple of years ago, I think. Um, and this is the perfect size. I've got one little sliver right here that I'm going to cut off. And I'll keep that as well because um, I've got an idea that I want to do with it. But I'm going to go ahead and mark this. Okay, so on this one, since it's square, I can't use the three jaw chuck. That's one of the drawbacks, so I'm going to have to go with the four jaw. We'll center drill it, and then we'll go ahead and um, drill it out and get it mounted on the barrel. Alright, so let's go ahead and give it a swirl. But you can get these bits on Amazon. They have a whole kit that you can get for drilling, for trimming the ends uh, once you get them mounted uh, they make all kind of, you can get all this stuff on Amazon anymore and we got a little bit of blowout on the back side but that's okay we'll trim it up it'll be fine so we're doing the tiny giant like I said this is a uh, Turner's warehouse Kit. So I'm just scuffing this at randomly so it'll have something for the adhesive to key into and grab. So I got these bottles of CA glue. Um, I think I might have got them on Amazon. I'll try to leave a link. So I got two big bottles and two cans of accelerator and it's a really good deal I don't see I have to see if I can remember where I got them from but I think it was pretty much one of the better deals I've seen so what I'm doing is I'm just gonna drizzle this all over and Then we'll stick it in the blank. And what I do, I used to have a little tool that I'd made for doing this, and you can buy these tools too, but you don't have to. But just do that. Make sure your nozzle's pointing the right way and don't shoot yourself in the eye. Hit it with some activator. And it's, it's good to go. This slides on there. We'll lock that down and we'll just push that in. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Let's sped up. See what she looks like before I. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take it down just a little bit more right there. Which actually, it kind of looks like it should be there, but I want this one to be a little more elegant because it's a smaller pin. So 
Just shave that down just a little bit. Yeah, that's going to look really nice once I get it sanded. We'll go. We will sand this from 150 all the way up to 600 grit. And then we'll use the micro mesh. I am um, wetting my sandpaper and I'll wipe this down in between each grit with a shop rag. Uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and crank this um, speed up. All right, so let's get my sandpaper wet here. Like I said, it doesn't really need a whole lot. It was in pretty good shape, but you always got to do a little sanding. And then we'll turn it off and we'll just go over, go on the other way, just to make sure we didn't miss anything. And that's our first grit out of the way. So we're going to wipe that off. I like this, uh, these rolls of sandpaper from Rockler. You don't have to use up a whole sheet or whatever. You just, because it doesn't take much to do a pen. It's already looking really shiny. Now for the micro mesh. And to paraphrase Peter Brown, it's their own grit system. It runs from 1500 through to 12,000. And you just do each step, just like you would sandpaper, just dip it in water or soak it in water beforehand. And then we'll just go just like this. And finally, 12,000. And that's it for the micro mesh. Now some Yorkshire grit for resins and hybrids and wood. Here's the other, and it says for wood turning. So I haven't done any wood pin blanks in a while. Oh man, this is sweet. I am not mad about that at all. I absolutely love this blank. Okay, so this, like I said, is from Turner's Warehouse, and it didn't come with instructions the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put the tip on oh you can see yeah there's you can see how shiny that is top comes off goes on this side and you got a pin doop, doop. And then it goes back on. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you enjoyed this uh, turning as much as I enjoyed doing it and showing y'all. Like and subscribe and we will see you in the next video.